So welcome to the fourth JavaScript tutorial and in this tutorial I'm going to be showing you how to use basic math functions like uh, addition, subtraction, multiplication and division inside of your program, inside of your website. So what we'll do is we'll create two variables and allow the user to, well, it will just display the sum of them. So for this we're going to need two variables as I said. So no sorry, three variables in total, one to store the first number, one to store the second number and want to store the total. So we're going to create a var first, var second, and then var total. And what we're also going to do is just set it equal to the first one, 15, and the second one as 85. So the sum of these should equal 100, and what our program will do is add them up together. So as you Note it must have noticed. I didn't put speech marks around this for a reason. Numbers do not need to have speech marks around them. If you want to do maths with them, then they cannot have speech marks around them. If they have speech marks around them, they'll be treated as a string. And strings don't do much apart from display text. So, what we're going to do, uh, the total we don't know yet. Well, we do, but the program's going to add them up for us because we're lazy and the pro we want the program to do that. So, that is what the total is going to do. So, we don't know what that is yet. So we're going to do var total, sorry, not var, I keep doing that, total equals and then first plus second. It's as easy as that, it is really simple. So we can just save that and launch in Chrome. Oh, we didn't display it. It always helps to display it. So we're going to do document right? And then here we're going to do total. Save that. Make, make sure you've got all your semicolons as well. That's really important. And then launch in Chrome. And there you've got 100, which is the answer we expected. So now what about if we want to divide 15 by 85? We just do a forward slash. Because in computers, a forward slash means divide. Launch in Chrome. And we've got 0 0.1764. You can read it. Uh, what, what else? What if we want to do minus? That's simple, you guessed it, it's a minus sign. So, launch your crow. And we've got negative 70. Like 70 below 0. And then the last one, multiplication. And that is just an asterisk sign. You get shift and 8 for that. Run it, launch your crow. And we've got 1275. And I'm just going to assume that that's what the, that's equal. So that is your basic math functions in JavaScript. So thank you for watching this tutorial. Don't forget to comment, rate, and subscribe. And I'll see you in the next tutorial.